Brussels, a Belgian zoo said Friday that a pair of hippopotamuses in its care are in isolation after testing positive for COVID-19, possibly the first time ever such animals have caught the disease. Belgium's National Veterinary Lab has confirmed that Antwerp Zoo's two hippos, Imani, aged 14, and 41-year-old Hermine, contracted COVID-19. It's unclear how they caught it. Both the giant semi-aquatic herbivores are well, apart from exceptionally runny noses. Keepers have tightened virus restrictions around the zoo. To my knowledge, it's the first recorded contamination among this species. Throughout the world this virus has mostly been seen in great tapes and felines, Antwerp Zoo vet Francis Verkamen said. How the hippos got the disease remains a mystery. All the zoo's animals were tested for COVID-19 last year and no case was found. Hippos' noses normally tend to be wet, but Verkamen said he decided to test the thick liquid coming out as a precaution, and was surprised by the result. The hippo's enclosure has been closed to visitors and will only be reopened once the pair test negative. Their handlers have all tested negative for the virus, and must wear masks and safety glasses, and disinfect their footwear before approaching the two animals. The hippo's positive test comes after other zoo animals have contracted the virus. In November, three snow leopard at a Nebraska zoo died from COVID-19 complications, while nine big cats contracted the virus at the Smithsonian Institution's National Zoo in D.C. in September. Dr. Jose Arce, president of the American Veterinary Medical Association, told USA Today in November said most animals can recover from the virus quickly and can be treated with antibiotics and steroids. Some zoos, including ones in Oakland and Cincinnati, have vaccinated their animals against the virus. Contributing, Jordan Mendoza, USA Today.